Right, we're in the car and uh, we're almost getting ready to go to Creamfield. So I'm Gavin. This is Paul. Hello. It's Tom. Hi, how's it going? Uh, we're just waiting for Dom. Uh, we'll be back in a minute. Okay, here's Paul's little mascot. Uh, there's the sex shop. Uh, just up there is uh, It's About Websites HQ. Okay, so we're, we're still in the car now, waiting for Dom. Um, it's been about 10 minutes since we last spoke. Um, I don't know. Uh, I mean, it's a, it's a long street. She could have been eaten by werewolves or dragons or something. Shiny vampires could have gotten t taken a face off. We don't know. We, do, we just don't know where she is. Um, we'll keep you posted. It's now been 20 minutes. Very worried now. Uh, rain's coming. Her hair might get wet. Um, a bit worried about these werewolves as well. There's um, Edward Cullen, quick. Edward Cullen's over there. Quick. Quick. Somebody over there walking, walking down the street. Maybe they know where Dom is. Have you seen Dom? <laughs> no. We'll be back in another 10 minutes. Okay, we've now been waiting for half an hour and there's still no sign of Dom. Um, we're all getting a little bit worried, a little bit scared. It's, uh, it's a bit of a repeat of the Blair Witch Project in here at the moment. It's, uh, it's all getting a little bit scary. So, Dom, where have you been? We've been really worried. Uh, get in the car, come on, let's go. Oh, I'll just let Dom in. Hang on. How do we open these doors? I can't open the door from this side. It's alright, Dom, you can come in now. Oh, no, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm so late. Oh, it was just like, there was vampires and werewolves everywhere. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm not even wearing my calm t-shirt. I've got, I, I wore this, this is a Christmas one. I got changed in the dark, I'm so sorry. Oh, God! Okay, 40 minutes now, and still no sign of Dom. Obviously, we took the mick just with uh, the lady in the sex shop. It wasn't really Dom. If it was, we'd be on our way to Creamfields, getting ready to actual interview people. In fact, it's getting dark. What's going on? Bloody hell, it's, it's like 8 o'clock. Oh, we're never going to catch the Chemical Brothers and interview them. What are we going to like, speak to them about? It's like, kind of, Tom, Ed, what's your favourite colour? And they're going to say, blue. <laughs> Okay, so we're, we're still waiting on Dom. Um, apparently, she is coming up Bold Street as we speak. Um, let's go find her. Come on, let's go. We're not quite on Bold Street yet. This is going to be a long journey. Has anyone seen Dom? Anyone seen Dom? Sorry. No one's seen Dom yet. Have any of you guys seen Dom? Nobody seen Dom? 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 Dom! There's a car, there's no Dom. Stuck up. Watch out, you're gonna, you're gonna hit people! Okay, 50 minutes now. It's crazy madness. The heavens have opened. Tom's looking a little bit. Dom, 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 Luckily, though, we're still advertising calm. Ding. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we've had a positive sighting of Dom. Um, we're we're off. Potentially Dom-shaped object. A um, lot of panic about water and electricity today. Um, how's the monkey doing? Monkey's fine. Oh, I'm so sorry! <laughs> right, we're going down uh, Liverpool's uh, famous Bold Street. It's got lots of nice stuff on it. And a Tesco's. <laughs> oh, no, <laughs> uh, okay. Right. If anybody can spot a Dom. Bold Street Coffee, if you like coffee. If you like coffee, go to Bold Street Coffee. Um, always good coffee. And, and cake. On Bold Street, so they're not lying, yeah, uh, we've got the Italian Club here. Another. Very, very good place to eat <laughs> burgers. <laughs> okay, this rain's not going to be very good for our entertainment value later this afternoon. <laughs> um, traffic seems to have backed up because everybody's doing rubbernecking looking at Dom. <laughs> Hopefully she's not been um, touched by the werewolves. Um, but if she has, we'll have an exclusive interview in about two minutes in the back of the car. Okay, we have to remember there is other shops on Bolt Street as well, such as for, for Forbidden Planet. I, I, I like that. Tom likes Forbidden Planet, so we won't comment on that. 
Uh, we have uh, the lovely uh, Leaf on Bowl Street, um, providers of fine teas and excellent sausage sandwiches. And many, many meetings. Mm, many meetings. We've got trainers, um, and we have uh, travel. Right, here's Oxfam coming up. Oxfam, Oxfam is where Dom is. Okay, don't forget matters for all your, uh, your food needs as well. Excellent international foods there. Okay, everybody, keep your eyes open for Dom. We're looking for a Dom. We're looking for a Dom. Oh. Got We've got a group of people. May, may have been orchestrated by Dom. Uh, is there a Dom in there? I don't see a Dom, I don't see a Dom either. Peep the horn. Peep Dom. the horn. Let's try and attract a Dom. Just find the windows down. Ah, uh, right. Where's Dom? Where's Dom? Where's Dom? Come on, Dom. She's got blonde hair now. Oh, we. We've, 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 we've go. Yeah, go on, Tom. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Paul's going. We're, we're, we're doing, we're doing running commentary. There goes Paul. He is running, and we're commenting on. Very camply running. Ah, <laughs> uh, as you see, the stars of the show are keeping dry. <laughs> okay. I'm not going to ruin my uh, no. face for this. Exactly. There goes the, the bags. Hi, Dom. Th there's Tom. Hi, Hi, Dom. Dom. Uh, is that not, that, not a monkey after not Dom? I think that's somebody oh, called that's Luke. Dom's friend, isn't Luke. Dom's friend Luke. We forgot about him. Oh. I should have mentioned a little bit about Dom's friend Luke. He's 22 years old and interviews people as well, maybe. Oh, brilliant. Thanks. And here comes Dom now. She's coming into the car with uh, with a few bags with 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 more with more belongings than is absolutely ever required. I've just been in Oxfam and Jacobs to scrounge bags for the camera equipment that's just got drenched. Yeah. Can't really say much to that. It's actually quite clever thinking. Yeah. <laughs> so thank you Oxfam. I feel really bad I didn't even give you 10p. <laughs> <laughs> Kevin, if if you put your face to the window it feels like you're running at an incredible pace. Look how fast we're going. Well, we're still on the way to Greenfields. Uh, I'm sitting alongside Dom, um, who was, who's notorious for being incredibly late. Uh, Dom, what's the latest you've ever been to an interview or a meeting? Two hours. Oh, <laughs> why were you two hours late? Don't know. A little, little, little turn of the head, and that's all you need. Hello, monkey. I'm so sorry! I'm so sorry! I'm sorry! I can't even move! Are we, are we, are we, update. <laughs> we're still in the car right now, we're still in the car, we're heading down the railroad. Uh, we've got many more cars. The railroad, real road, real road, real road, I don't even know anymore. All, all I know is that we're still in the car. The car's swerving, the car's weaving. Because it's on a railroad um, now. Because, well, if it was on a railroad, it wouldn't, it wouldn't be swerving or weaving at all, would it? So you're told. Um, we've, got, the wheels have been adapted. we've got we've got um, many cars in front of us. We've got many cars behind us. Um, in front in, in front of us we have Creamfields. Uh, behind us, so there's cre <laughs> there's Creamfields. The, the many cars. Uh, uh, apparently that's where David Guetta is currently travelling right now. Oh, yeah, David Guetta. Oh. VIP travelling. <laughs> uh, there's the there's the Runcorn Bridge. Um, when I, when I was uh, little, my mum told me a lie about the Runcorn Bridge, and she said that we would go over the Runcorn Bridge, and I thought we would actually go <laughs> over the top of it. You can imagine how disappointed I was when I got to the other side of the bridge, and I realised where I was. <laughs> We've got some interesting facts about Runcorn. Do we? Yeah. We do? Yeah, it's, um, it's the home of uh, the hilarious sitcom, Two Pints Lager and a Packet of Crisps. Uh, is it still going? How do they get more than one series? I'm really looking forward to this pilot of Five People in a Car. Five People in a Car. <laughs> I mean, we're going to work on a name, it's a working title. Five People on a Railroad. Enjoy the bridge. Here we go, we're going to go over the bridge. This is the opening credits. We should um, cue flashback. Greenfields. Yeah. Oh, we've got a bridge. We've got a bridge in the air. We've got a bridge, and nobody seems to care. We've, we've got, got a, a castle. We've got a castle too. We've got a bridge, and I just haven't a clue. <laughs> Welcome. Available to now to download on iTunes. Oh, Welcome to the world of tomorrow. <laughs> Hello, monkey. I'm so sorry.
Okay, we think we've come the right way. We're, we're going to be part of uh, looking for the production thing, so we're going to ask this dude. Excuse me, mate, no, we're after the production entrance. You need to turn round here. Yeah, go on. Sorry. Turn round here. You go straight up the road, through the lights, past the Daresbury Village Hall entrance. Yeah. And uh, there's a production, it says production sign on the left hand side, and it's immediately opposite on the right. Excellent, thank you very okay. much. Have a good day, sir. Excellent. Guess what? Yeah. He. He. He'd had. Um. Damn! <laughs> you know, I just want everyone to be late. It's my thing. So, there we go. Lesson, lesson number one today. Don't rely on Dom. <laughs> okay, we're here at Creamfields. It's looking really, really nice. Uh, yep. This is what festivals are all about. Queuing. <laughs> Queuing. <laughs> we can have, we've got some free beer here. We put that down because you've just got cooties. <laughs> well, we got Paul Court over there. He's uh, he's keeping marking well. He's uh... well. Well, here we are. I, I seem to be the only person who's not underneath an umbrella at the moment. Um, I don't understand what's happened. That yes, Dom served a purpose by cutting my face off. Come on, woman. <laughs> oh, you know what? We're just about to get our accreditation um, so we can walk around amongst the masses and talk to all the famous Hollywood celebrities that may be around here at the moment, um, as well as all the other the little people.